think we might actually see the Crossroads Demon. The location here is key to why that history is what inspires the story behind the haunted ghost town. It is horrible. It is bizarre. Crossroads! Ooh. They've known something was off. What do you want us to do? You want us to sell our souls to you? Is that what you want? Dude, holy sh**. You heard it? What about the devil, not as a symbol, but as an actual willful being? Don't mess with me. Whoa! Grave! Oh, dude! No way, dude. Whoa! That says grave. I don't like this, dude. This feels weird over here by yourself. What the f Oh, oh, no. oh it's a photo! Don't look at him! Don't look, look at, at him! him. We don't die. We're totally not gonna die. Did you guys ever think in our lifetime that we would go sell our souls at a crossroads? Yeah, I saw that one coming. Well, I really hope that they can do three wishes because I have three of the best Jesus! Whoa! I have three of the best wishes. My first wish would be for me to own my very own Taco Bell. Taco Bell this, Taco Bell that. Dude, this place is creepy. Taco Bell. Oh my god, dude, this place looks crazy! Today we are at the famous ghost town called Rhyolite, and apparently this place is super, super haunted. It's uh, stupidly dangerous, and we're gonna go crawling around in that at nighttime. Didn't you just see like a ginormous tarantula on the ground? It's right there. I hate spiders. You should have seen him take a shower the other day and out of nowhere he's just screaming. I run in there and he's like, <gasps> SPIDER! <laughs> but not a problem because yours truly, Ryan Reese, came and smushed it with this finger. This town has numerous abandoned buildings and each one of them has their own creepy haunted story. Not only that, somewhere very close to us is one of Hell's Crossroads. Back, mother so tonight, we are here to find out what kind of mysteries are held here in Rhyolite. But before we do that, it is time for the history. Guys, I found a tarantula. Thank God it wasn't an actual tarantula. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Built in 1905 after a discovery of a massive amount of gold ore, Rhyolite was one of the many mining camps in the area that quickly became known as the Bullfrog Mining District. While these camps were common, Rhyolite stood out because of how much gold they were producing. Word of this had started to spread very quickly, and what was once a two-tent operation had become a town of 5,000 people in just six months. An abandoned mining town about 125 miles north of Las Vegas. It does look like a bunch of ghosts standing side by side, and it was all because of what was hidden up in the mountains. This town had so much success that it even caught the attention of a very wealthy businessman named Charles Schwab. Now thanks to him, he had bought the bullfrog, turning this town into the most luxurious of its time. Things had started to change very dramatically in the area. They had sidewalks, telephones, electricity, and even railroads servicing the town. However, just as soon as this town came up, it wouldn't take long for it to fall from its glory. It's been nearly four years since a California family disappeared without a trace. The final blow happened in 1906 when San Francisco had a huge earthquake cutting off all ties between the railroad stations. Within decades, mines and businesses had closed and even the power was shut off causing people to leave. By 1920, only 14 people remained. Some of those final people were Mona Bell and Fred Skinner. Now these two had a love affair together and ran away to Rhyolite many years ago in search of riches. Mona found work as a lady of the night and Fred made all his money gambling. But eventually, Mona attracted way too much attention from the local men and Fred became extremely jealous. Now the story has it that as the town eventually died off, the two had gotten into a huge argument over money. Fred was so upset that he had actually shot and killed Mona. Another rumor has it that she is buried in an unmarked grave somewhere deep in the desert. For many years since her death, people have reported some very strange things near her gravesite. They often hear disembodied voices or sounds of footsteps approaching them when no one else is in that ghost town except them. But that's not the only weird thing. Many people have reported seeing the shadow figure of a man near her gravesite as well as throughout the rest of the town. Nobody knows who that shadow man could be as there were many other deaths in 
that area way back in the day, but many people speculate that it could be Fred, Mona's estranged lover. Engineer, where are you headed? Carry me back to Tennessee. Oh, I got a little girl who's been waiting. I'm his most people who come across this entity feel a very dark energy, which leads us to another theory on what they might be. There is said to be a crossroads that sits right on the outskirts of the town of Rhyolite. Rumor has it that some who went to Rhyolite looking for riches actually sold their souls at those crossroads. The story even goes as far as saying that those two men who had discovered that gold had sold their souls prior to actually finding it. Now this could just be a bunch of stories or it could be true. So our goal is to make our way to Rhyolite to find out if any of the stories that are lingering around that town are true. But before we do jump into this episode, if you guys are not subscribed to this channel and you keep finding yourselves coming back, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. We are on our way to 800,000 subscribers. And thanks to each and every one of you, we wouldn't be able to make this happen. Also, make sure you do hit that post notifications bell so that it lets you know when we do post every single Sunday. With all that being said, here's this week's three shout outs. Here, here, and here. If you guys would like to be shouted out next week's video, all you need to do is make sure you are following our Twin Paranormal Instagram account, go to the latest post, heart that post, and comment down below, hashtag the crossroads. And now it is time to jump into this terrifying episode. Okay guys, are you two ready? Because our very first stop is the crossroads. I'm scared. The fact that there's a full moon behind your head actually is I kind know, of freaky. Oh, dude, that just makes it so much more worse. <laughs> guys, you know what we do before each and every investigation. Put your hands together. Tonight, we are going to see how far we can dig. I, you know, really don't want to dig into the crossroads. I thought that's what he was saying. Like yeah. he had a shovel or something, like he's about to dig a hole. Right. You know you're supposed to actually dig a hole and, and bury, bury some stuff, stuff in the yeah. middle of the crossroads. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is the box we're gonna <laughs> We're gonna put the box in there. On the count of three. One, two, three, crossroads demon. We started out as semen, and now we are some he-man. he man Damn, we're good. Did you pray today? Did you pray today? It is time to go to the crossroads. We are standing here in the middle of these crossroads, and we are calling out to what people believe to be the crossroads demon. If there is such thing as an entity that is around us, can you please give us a sign? If you can, we have these devices that are around us. There's a device that is right in the middle of the crossroads. It is glowing red. We are just trying to find out if this truly is a real crossroad where people would come and sell their souls when this town was alive. If there is somebody around us as well that has nothing to do with this dark energy that involves these crossroads and is just here because they used to live here in this town, we would like to have a conversation with anybody around us. Before we do start asking you questions, I'd like to introduce myself and the two others that are here with me. My name is Ryan. My name is Wyatt. And my name is River. We're just here to have a conversation and find out who is here. We have these devices where you can use your words, whether it's one word or a whole sentence. So if you are around, maybe you can use your words. We are putting this in airplane mode so we have no interference. Speak loud and clear, please. Are you here? Move back. Move back. Get out of the crossroads. Are you saying not to be in the center? Walk forward. Oh, what the f Move back, walk, walk forward. forward. That's like somebody's like, yes, move forward. Go into the center. Uh -huh. Somebody else is like, no, get out of there. So someone can hear us. You can hear us. We have this device right here. Maybe you can touch that. There's also a couple of these round plastic balls that are at each end of the crossroads. All you need to do is slightly tap one of them for them to start lighting up. So if you would like to show us where you are, light one of them up. You just heard that? Bro, why is standing here so 
weird. Feels weirdly quiet and ominous right now. It does feel extra quiet. Give us a sign, please. Use your energy. We just want to know if you are truly around us. Full grab. Thank you. Certain. Certain. Guys, no f way. Did you just hear that? Am I tripping or was someone walking? Wait and see. Is somebody walking around? I was killed. I was, I was killed. killed. Who? What's your name? Are you a woman? The only reason why I am asking if whoever's speaking to us is a woman is because of that love story. Right. The man killed that woman, and she also shot him too, so it was like a double murder. Shall I make noise? Oh! Yes, please! No. no. Yes. Group of us. Group of us. Was that you? Can you do that again? It could have been an animal. Can somebody please let us know if this was used, or is still used, for people to come and sell their souls? Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Yeah, it just said, don't leave me. People would sell their souls for riches, for fame, for all kinds of things. Did this happen here at one point? I will keep. I will keep. I will keep. Keep their souls. Mm. Is this what people call the crossroads demon who is talking to us? Can you touch that red light again for us if that's you? The one right in the middle. Spirit here. Evil spirit. Two spirits. Evil, evil spirit, spirit here. here. Two spirits. What the f Okay, was it the evil do one? Do it now. Do it now. What do you want us to do? You want us to sell our souls to you? Yo, that's freaky. Is that what you want? That was really, really f weird. I just heard walking right there, and then it stopped, and then something was right there. Dude. Holy sh You didn't hear that one? Mm -mm. This is- She has gone. This sh she has gone. gone. The woman. Yes. Whoa. She has gone. Two spirits. One evil, and then the woman. She was the one who was telling us to go back. Mm -hmm. And then whoever this is, Potentially, I don't know if I even believe in the whole crossroads thing. Right. But if it is true, if it is real, they were telling us to go forward. Anyways, what I heard was somebody... One, two. Right in between me and you, Wyatt. And River heard it here. Yeah. Stopped. And then and over there. here. Maybe that was her leaving. It just said, yeah. Maybe she was the one that touched the REM pod, too. Can you set one of these devices off here? You just need to slightly tap them. Pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you. Oh, we introduced ourselves. Yeah. That's freaky. You ever heard all those stories about people that go to crossroads to sell their soul or whatever? And they say that the people you talk to are super f nice. Yeah, because they want to make sure. Why are you here? Oh, because they want to make sure that you are going to sign that contract. Mm -hmm. We're trying to come in contact with anybody who is here. But since we found this crossroads, we figured we might as well give this a shot, too. Will you come and talk to us and tell us the truth? Tell us how these deals work? You guys feel how extra cold it's getting right now? Like somebody is right here. Mm -hmm. Maybe you can give us the steps on how we can sell our soul to you. How did people do it? Unwanted. Unwanted? What, our souls aren't good enough for you? Oh, yo, Riv, did you bring the death whistle? Did you grab it out of the car? Yeah, I got it. Yo. Okay, I know we're not doing anything that has anything to do with skinwalkers, but if you think about it, this kind of, cause it's sounds. Oh, dude, holy f <laughs> As I was saying, this could stir up more energy or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm just gonna give it a try. Okay, here we go. The music box is going up. No, it's not. I hear it. Listen. It is. Oh, oh f that was really weird. Maybe that worked. Charge. Charge! Is this giving you energy? Dude? Yes. I heard that. Don't mess with me. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Uh oh. Did oh. they not like that? Are you getting upset? If this is not what people call the crossroads demon, if we are upsetting somebody else, we apologize. We are here to have a conversation with this dark entity. 
My life was taken. My life was taken. Mm -hmm. Died in this area. Oh, what the f Holy sh I don't want to say her name right now because I'm kind of testing this out. If her name comes out of the device, then this is actually her. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us your name? The woman? Moving closer. Oh! Dude, that's the walking. And I don't hear the music anymore. That's true. Don't provoke me. Don't, don't provoke, provoke me. Again, don't mess with me. It said just a few minutes Who ago. Who is it? Do you think it is the crossroads demon or whatever? I don't know. We're not 100% sure who we're talking to. The lady is talking to us. I'm very friendly. This is starting to get really freaky. Yo, what the f It just said I'm very friendly after Wyatt just got done saying that the crossroads, like when people would see them, they were extra nice. Yeah, mm -hmm. because then, they'd make sure, once again, they'd make sure that you wanted to sign that contract. I wonder who's all kind of pissed off. Maybe the woman? Oh, the Dude. girl, the woman. What are you trying to warn us about? Let go, please. Oh. Don't look at him. Don't, don't look, look at, at him. him. It just said, don't look at him. I'm here to warn you not to look at him. Holy f dude. Do you think we might actually see the Crossroads demon? Wait, is it true that you have to seal it with a kiss? Oh, yeah. Ah, I'm not going to kiss it, dude. No way. Me neither. Why can't we look at him? Stop doing. Stop, stop doing. doing. Dude, she's trying to get us, us to, to stop. Yeah. Excuse me, miss. If you give us your name, we'll walk away from here. We know your name. We just don't want to say it out loud, just in case if we are getting tricked. But if you could provide us that information, we will leave these crossroads and we'll go somewhere else. Argument. Oh, dude. That is why they killed each other. Yeah. It was literally over an argument. You know what's even crazier? Yes, I can. Yes, I can! I can. Provide their name. No Please way. do it. Provide your name for us. Her grave is right down there, dude. At least 200 feet away. That would be insane. Window. Window. Yeah. We have devices in a cabin window and the jail window. Mm -hmm. And, might I say, that jail, they would hold it's in there right they'd hold criminals and yeah ladies of the nights dude i don't know about you guys i'm hearing all sorts of weird sh yeah i don't even know how to describe it so i also have another question if you are in a crossroads and you're with someone wasn't it said that each individual person would feel or hear different things experience oh. their own yeah that's right guys look at that what the f no, look at that camera. Oh, is it dying already? That's brand new, we just put it in. They did say no energy. Yeah. Maybe they figured it out, they can use it. What the f dude? Should we rush over and change we, it? We have to. Who has a battery, I'll do it right now. I put one right on top of it. Okay. I'll just wait in the crossroads, in the dark. Yeah. Crossroads. Crossroads! Oh, holy f No f way, dude. Dude! Wyatt, did you hear that? I don't want to wait in the crossroads anymore. Access. Access. Access! Dude, it just said crossroads. We left Wyatt there and that just f happened. Yo, I'm getting a weird vibe in here right now. Demonic. Demonic! Dude! I don't like this, dude. This feels weird over here by yourself. My device just said demonic. Dude, the f odds of it saying crossroads, man. Wait, wait, for real? Before you come back in here, take like a breath and just tell me what feeling you feel when you come back in the middle. Okay, first things first. It's a hell of a lot warmer over here. Come back in here, tell me what you feel. Oh, dude, the moment you walk in. I have like the weirdest butterfly sensation, like just going up my back. You can go. You can, you go. can go. Somebody told us that this is the crossroads and also said that there is something- In front of me. In front of me? You can go in front of me? Oh, f dude. Where are you? As it was- Ooh. Whoa. As I was trying to say, somebody said demonic through my device. Is that you? You're the one who is said to be seen here. Whoa, what was that? That noise? What was that? That was like a weird high-pitched, like, uh -huh. squeak. Uh-huh. Dude, 
Holy sh! You heard it? Yeah. I think I hear the music box too. It's getting weird. Who is that? Who's over there? Guys, story says that when you go to the crossroads and begin the seance or the ritual that you need to perform in selling your soul, apparently once you start, it is said that you feel somebody watching around you. You feel somebody around. Apparently it's true until you finally seal that deal. Definitely. Whoa. Definitely. Until you finally seal that deal is when they actually confront you. That's kind of like what I was talking about, that butterfly feeling I have going on. I feel weird. It's also said that you like almost have a sense of hallucination. Like you start to hallucinate and see things. Correct. Correct. What Dude. the f Seriously. So where are you then? You just touched this. Can you show yourself to us? I wonder if the woman left. Either that or she's still around. Can don't either of you- people. Don't tell people. Keep the secret? That's weird. Can either of you show yourselves to us? Either one. I don't know guys, this is weird. This experience right now is really intense. Definitely. I don't even know where to look. Like, my eyes are just looking everywhere and I'm expecting to see something just standing there. Mm hmm like some dude just... Hey, hi, how you doing? Are you waiting for us to do everything that is necessary to perform a ritual to summon you? Is that what you're waiting for? I don't want to be in the middle any by myself anymore. I don't blame you. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you can explain how we need to do this. If we need blood, White's got plenty of it. Man, I'm just getting offered up here, dude. I'm like the, I'm like a fresh fish. You know? You know that website on Facebook called Offer Up? <laughs> you need Work. to sell your soul? Here's a Wyatt. <laughs> there you go. I don't even think that, like, I remember there was a link on Facebook to go to Offer Up. I think Offer Up was its own thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm just kidding, by the way, guys. Wyatt, we're not going to let Wyatt get taken. Yeah, that would suck. Uh, can you hold this real quick? Yeah. My phalanges are really cold. I will cross. I will cross! <laughs> I will cross. Cross where? Cross. Here. Go here. Where do you want us to go? I will cross not enough. You just got done saying that he has blood to give. Not enough blood? Or there's more to it than that. Right. I mean, there is. You, you are. You are enough. Dude. <laughs> I just want to put my gloves on. What the f Please don't attack us until I get my gloves on. <laughs> We don't know how to do this ritual that you're talking about. We don't know what else we need. I wonder if when they said, I will cross, like, over. You yes, know what that's I'm saying? what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Like, they're standing right there. They're probably, like, on a different plane that it's we can't totally... see. No joke, if we all turned around and there was a guy standing there in a suit, oh, f I would quit. Why are you doing this, Wyatt? I would quit. I'd be gone. Right? Where the f do we run? I don't even care. Not here? What if he's not even in a suit? What if he's in like a onesie? What if he's naked? <laughs> or naked. What? Remember you gotta seal the deal with a kiss, so if he's Please move back. Please move back again. Where? Where would you like us to go? What the f Did you guys hear that? What? Did you guys hear that? Sounds like movement. Somebody moving around over there. This is too f man. Who are- Too many dead. Too many too dead. Too many dead. What? No, so many dead. So many dead. That's f weird. Who exactly was it that said my brother's name? Are you trying to have me perform the ritual to summon you? Imagine it says, you need a box, you need to fill it, you need to put grave dirt in it, you need- well, you guys remember, uh -huh. well, you guys remember when we were at Case Cross, they told us how to perform a ritual. Mm hmm Dude, I am driven. I literally looked over to Wyatt and I thought I saw someone standing you. I'm serious. Can you show us with any of these devices that you're here?
Dude, does that sound like a bunch of people whispering the same thing? What in the hell? It kind of does sound like whispering. What yeah. the f is that? Dude, imagine somebody's just like walking, like just down the trail, and he's like, one, 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 two, 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 one, 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 two, yeah. two, 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 one, it one, does one, sound two, like two, that. Two, two. What the f what it sounds like. It sounds like a bunch of people are saying it, but just imagine it's one person and he's speaking this, but it just sounds like a bunch of people speaking out of his mouth. That's scary. This crossroads is legitimately gonna make us start hallucinating here any second. I'm already hallucinating, bro. <laughs> like, I'm feeling weird. Can somebody confirm to us that this is a crossroads? Somebody? Dude, no. No way did you not hear that? What? That was a person speaking. What? Where? Right over here. Right over here, dude. I swear on everything, someone just spoke. Dude, that was f***ed up, man. Hello? Do it now! Do it now! Again. Perform the ritual? Okay, I'm ready. Do I, like, play blues or something? Good luck. I mean, I know how to do it, but... Do you? Yeah. It's kind of one of those things, you know, you get interested in, and then you're like, ah, oh, gotta dig deep, and then you start Other it. side. Other side. I'll cross, it said earlier. That's what we were talking about. Wait, does it want me over there? I don't think it means physically. Yeah, but I there... think it means like spiritually. So if you're on the other candle. Oh! <laughs> Light a candle. Bro. Whoa! Light a candle. Whoa! Okay. That is crazy. So if you're on the other side, can you see us right now? Is lighting a candle just an initial thing for you to appear? Do you need to light a candle, Riv? Uh, no, you don't. <laughs> no, essentially you need some sort of box or something. Uh, you need grave dirt. You need uh, bones from a black cat. Um, you need something from you, some of your hair. Um, How does he know all of this? True. Also, what did we see when we literally first got here? A black cat! Black cat! We yeah. saw a black cat! There's like a baby black cat around here somewhere. Dude. What the f***? That's Weird, man. We saw the black cat go that way, where those lights are. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's the old train depot. Please tell me you heard that. Yeah. What the f*** do we do, guys? We can't go selling souls. I don't want to sell a soul anyways. You know, I like my soul. But Disagree. Disagree, okay. He wants me to sell I guess, soul. I I mean, we don't have all the stuff, but if we really needed to, for scientific purposes, I guess I could do it. And only live for like five years? Yeah. I thought it was 10. It depends what you want. If you want fame and fortune, like right away. What the f was that? That was like growling. Are we about to Watch get hit by a hellhound? Ball. No, hellhounds are involved once your contract is up. Mm. Well, at least in Supernatural. Good show. At some point, we're gonna make our way to a different area. We are trying to come in contact with a woman. She was here. And if you can hear me, if you are still around. Hiding. Hiding. We would love to have a conversation with you. We understand maybe you don't feel comfortable with being here at the crossroads. And that is okay. Because we are going to... Full grab. We are going to make our way towards your grave. Dude, dude you Wyatt, heard that? Wyatt. Oh, I heard that. Shut the f up. Shh, that was not you. That was not me. Hold on, hold on. Shut the f up. Dude, was what the f was that? That was a voice. That was a straight up full of voice. Yeah. That's kind of freaking me out, boys. Was somebody just speaking? Yo, this area is f crazy. It is really f crazy. My heart. Dude, I can feel my heart when I'm crossing my arms like this, and it is pumping, dude. Like, my adrenaline is a little high. Yeah, I don't blame you. They said your name. Portal. Portal? Portal. Crossover. Dude. Are we able to see the other side? Could you just imagine a f portal appearing out of nowhere? Why don't we just, just like... stand straight in the middle of this thing? You want to? Yeah. Nah, man. Look. If this is truly a portal, 
And if somebody is around us waiting for us to perform something so that I'm we- I'm beside you. I'm beside I'm you. I'm beside you. Dude. No. Oh! No. What the f Did you- Listen, I said, if somebody is around us, and they said, I am right beside you. Literally, and the f REM pod goes off. Voice. 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 Dude. Is that what we heard? Your voice. Were you approaching us? We want to see you. We want to know why you are here. I just want to know what the f*** that was, man. Like, honestly, I really want to know. I feel like maybe they don't want to talk to us, or... See, we could be completely wrong. They could want to talk to us. But how would you feel if you were waiting for somebody to try and seal a deal and they're not doing it? Mm -hmm. Like, would you want to stick around? Yeah, it's like they suck the camera battery, add a bunch of energy to talk yeah, to us. Yeah, they're like, like, this might be it. I might gain a soul right now, and then, oh, no, it's just three assholes who don't have a box with, like, cat litter. It's not cat litter. It's grave dirt. Now, if you buried someone in cat litter, then yes, probably, right? Yeah, I don't know. If you're burying someone in cat litter, then isn't it considered grave dirt? Grave litter. Dust. Grave dust. That black cat would have a field day if someone was buried in cat litter here. <laughs> this is your last chance. We're gonna move on. Jail. Jail! Dude! Whoa. That's where I was no, gonna say we were going to go. It's literally right there. That's where, where the, music the music box, box is going up. Reaction. No hope. No hope. Reaction. No, no hope. hope. What the f the Dude. Reaction. No hope. Is that kind of like going with what oh. I was just Don't saying? Say it. Don't, Don't say, say it. Entities. Several entities. I think that is going with what yeah. you're saying. Somebody is watching us and they're a little upset they're that like, we're not actually. You don't have the shit to do yes. it. Mm -hmm. So, no hope. Yeah. Wow, dude. That is incredible. You guys want to go to the jail? That's where the music box is going off. And the woman said that she left. Yeah. Maybe she went back that way. Her grave's over there, too. You guys want to go? I'm pretty sure the crossroads are real, man. Yeah, I'm, this is pretty f weird. Well, here's the thing. If we get anything more involving the crossroads, we will... Find me. Find me, the woman! No way right before that came out i heard a scream yo okay as i was trying to say if anything more comes up that involves the crossroads we'll make our way back here but as of right now let's make our way to that jail you had mentioned this jailhouse through our device now we are here we are looking to speak with that woman that was talking to us earlier so if you are here and if you directed us here for a reason can you please make yourself known? We want to have a conversation with you and find out your story. Can you please give us your name? You're very famous here. Maybe he was killed. He was killed. Suddenly he was killed. I was just thinking about calling out to her husband also. Whoa. That was part of the whole thing. If there is someone here that's been in this jailhouse, maybe you can tell us why you got here. What happened? Did you do something bad? Or were you wrongfully accused of something? This area definitely does not feel as bad as the crossroads did. No. Mm -mm. Here in a little bit, I'd like to try this method. I have two- Stand up. Stand up. What the f <laughs> We've gotten sit down, but we've never gotten stand up. Maybe I'm like, in their way or something. Oh, f what? Rimpod. Was I in your way? Meet. Meet. Samuel. Meet Samuel. Meet Samuel. Hi, Samuel. As I was trying to say, I have these two flashlights. What I'd like to do is set one in that window and one in that window. When I go ahead and set the flashlight in the left window, we are going to go ahead and ask a series of questions, and that flashlight will indicate a no. When I set the other flashlight in the right window, that will indicate a yes. You guys want to try the flashlight method? Yeah. Let's do it. Now that those flashlights are in the windows, will you turn one of them on to let us know that you are here? I'm really here. What the f***? Dude. Okay. 
Dead. Dead. Can you please turn one of those flashlights on? All you have to do is touch it. Give it a tap. There you go. Perfect. Thank you. Now that side indicates a no. Can you turn the other one on for a yes? Show us a yes, please. If you need more energy or... Oh. Dude. Guys. What? Hello. Find the truth. Yes! Mona! Mona! Mona. Yes! Dude, dude, dude! It said Mona, hello, find, find the, the truth. truth. And then the f***ing yes turns on. Oh my god. Holy Thank you, oh. Mona. Mona, you are here. Can you turn that yes off? Can you turn that flashlight off, please? Dude, we, we got her f***ing name. We actually got her name. And it said find the truth? What the hell? What do you mean by that? Oh, off. Holy shit, dude, I have the chills. Thank you for doing that. Can you answer a few questions for us? I'm gonna start with this one. Were you killed by your husband? Take your time. Leave me. Leave, Leave me. Yes! Yes! Yes. Thank you so much. Wow. Real quick, as I was trying to say just a second ago, if you need any more energy, all of these things that we have that we brought have power in them that you can use. Please turn that off. Thank you. Watch what I do. Watch, Watch what, what I do. do. <laughs> and then the no. Exit. Exit. Leave me. Exit. Office. Can you please? This was an office, wasn't it? I think this it would have been where the office was. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Can you please turn the no off? Agree. Thank Whoa. you. Thank Agreed. you so much. You have to leave them both off so we can ask you another question. Were you the one warning us when we were at the crossroads? Was that you, Mona? Yes! Dude, right away. Wow, thank you so much. Spells. Thank you so much. Spells? What? Spells. Whoa. Please turn that off. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Whoa. Do you see that? Yes and then no. Right. Why did you turn on the flashlight? Mona, Mona again. again! What no. the f dude? Says Mona again. Again? Yes. yes! Dude, this is 100% undeniably the ghost of the woman that's buried like a few hundred feet that way. What was crazy is she was giving us like so much information when we were at the crossroads about herself, mm -hmm. yet she didn't give us her name. Instead, she left and then told us where she was or somebody told us where she was. They said jail. Mm -hmm. Now we're here, we get her name. That's insane. That is crazy. Now we're only about 100 feet, maybe less, maybe 80 feet from her grave. Mona, do you know where you're buried? Yes. yes. Please turn that off real quick. You're doing great. Thank you. Uh, oh. Whoa. What the f Was that a double confirmation? Oh. Holy sh Mona, please turn that off. I have another question I'd like to ask. Mona, we understand that you were a lady of the night. Did people treat you badly here? Yes. Yes. Holy dude. Did that make you want to leave? No. No. I had a weird feeling that she would have turned the no on. Because when everybody left, Due to the gold not being mined anymore, basically drying out, she decided to stay behind. So she was one of the only ones left here with her husband who had murdered her. Whoa. So why would she have wanted to stay here? Maybe she grew attached to this place. Can you turn both of them off? Thank you. Mona, earlier you said that we needed to find the truth. Is there something we don't know about your death? Is there a secret? Yes. 
Dude, this is fun. Whoa! That was fast. Yes, yes. Yep, it did like a triple. Turn it off, please. Illness. I had an injury. What? Illness. Illness. I had, I had an injury. That's weird. Blinking, no. I wonder if there's more than just her. That's what I'm thinking. Here that keeps interrupting us. There was a man who came in. Yeah. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out for who? Is there a dark spirit here? Can you answer that, please? Yes. yes. Oh. Can you find my grave? Can Whoa. you find my grave? What the? F Are you? Is this Mona? Are you talking to us right now? We know where your grave is. So maybe she's not really buried there. I don't know. I was just going to say. Here's the problem. Some think that your body is buried where there is a grave here. Now others say that you are buried somewhere else. Which one is the truth? Are you frightened? Oh. We don't know how to answer that because dark energy feeds off of fear. Here's my question. If your body is buried right over there, can you turn the flashlight on to the right? If your body is buried somewhere else, can you turn the flashlight on that's to the left of us? Oh, yes. oh. So your grave is, in fact, over there, where people bring flowers and all kinds of other gifts for you. Thank you. Dude. I think that was a very good flashlight session. That was pretty crazy. Thank you, Mona. We really appreciate you. Mona, would you like us to go and visit your grave? We would love to. If not, we don't have to. Yes. Ooh. That's cool. Whoa. Guys. What? It just said box. box. Dude, that's weird. Because remember earlier, I said something about the box in the crossroad. What if we're getting tricked? Son of a Oh, and it's Do not you even... believe in us? Whoa! Do you believe in us? And it's not even Mona? Yes, we do. The f Bro. I don't know. Mona, is there another man here? That darker presence? True. True. Can oh. you confirm it with that flashlight, please? Oh! Is that him? Oh, dude. Wow. Can you please let go of that? Yes. Confirmed it. Can you let go of that, please? What the f is he going He died. He died. Dude. Mona, is it your husband? Can you either step closer or back up a little bit? Oh! <laughs> and then what? a grab. What is happening? Mona, is, is he standing right there? Is that him doing that? Can you tell us yes or no? This is freaky. Yes. Yes. So far, they have not turned on the no. I'm gonna reset it. I don't know what's going on. Energy. 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 That's wild. Mona, we're gonna make our way to your grave. We have this other device that will give us the ability to hear what your voice actually sounds like. You guys want to go to her grave? Yeah. Let's go. The others mean harm. The oh others mean my god! The others mean harm. We literally just got to the grave. We're trying to set up this camera so there's something looking at all of us. And that's the first word that pops out. Mana, we are here at your grave. Was your real name Isabel? She had a bunch of uh, aliases, fake names. What was your real name? I can't protect you. Whoa, I the can't. others mean harm, I can't protect you. Holy That's okay, Mona. We're not looking for your protection. We just want to have a conversation with you. This right here is an EMF meter. It detects electric magnetic fields. So it's just like the other coffin shaped ones that we do use every so often. This one we haven't used in a while, so thought it might be a good time to... Woman! Oh. Woman! 
What? Thought it might be a good time to bring this one out. I'm gonna go ahead and actually set it here on this cross. Mona, if you were around us, can you walk up to this device right here that is on the top of your cross? Oh, what? That's a f what the? No, f no stop, Max. Wait. She's. Is that you right there, Mona? What's going on? It's just stuck. Can you let go of it now? What? It's literally just stuck. That really just happened. That really just f happened. She might have bugged it out. Oh, what the f Did you just see that? It was stuck. Can you do that again? Please. That was... Oh. This is really happening. This is f crazy, bro. Probably not. Probably not. Probably not. Do you need energy to do so? Because if you need energy, we have these cameras here. Use the energy out of those. Real. Real? This is happening right now. Mona, do you like talking with us? Yes, it happened again. Oh my oh, God. And it went back. You guys want to try an EVP? I think we have to. Okay, let's do an EVP. Mona, I don't know if you heard me explaining this at the jail, but this device gives us the ability to hear what your voice actually sounds like. It's stuck again. Dude, what the <laughs> f is going on? If you can, we are going to ask a couple of questions. In between those questions, please speak loud and clear into this device. You guys ready? Yeah. Let's start it off. Mona, if you are here, can you please say your name in that device? Mona, can you tell us what happened to you? And what's this truth you wanted us to learn? What's the secret? Can you tell us? Okay, are you guys ready? This thing is amazing. I forgot how crazy this was. Yeah. We haven't used it in a long time. Literally. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Mona, if you are here, can you please say your name in that device? What? No. No. Mona, if no. you are here, can you please say your name in that device? Oh, oh, it said Mona! Yeah. Mona! Whoa! Can you tell us what happened to you? And what's the truth you wanted us to learn? What's the secret? Can you tell us? What the f I don't f what was no, that dude. one? That I have no long. idea. I can't believe the very first one said, Mona. That is pretty clear. But what gets me sometimes when we do EVPs is, why is the voice not woman-like? Right. That's what's confusing me. Mm -hmm. They always sound so scratchy. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's just different, but here's the thing, like we've gotten like a female's voice, we've gotten like a child voice. And, voices. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So I wonder if that has like a difference with how much power they're able to. What? Just maxed again. Oh, it just did a little one too. Mona, or anybody else, once again, speak loud and clear into this device, please. We are going to try this one more time. Mm -hmm. It just did it. You guys ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. Mona, can you confirm that your husband had shot you and that you shot him back before you passed away? Is your husband here right now as well? Is this where you're actually buried? That just keeps going. It does. Mona, can you confirm that your husband had shot you and that you shot him back before he passed away? Oh! Uh -huh. Hold on, that's just something shot. 
What the f was that? What? Did you hear the laughing afterwards? Yes. It was like, uh, 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 uh. Yeah. That is so f weird. Dude, I feel like her husband is like this other energy that just kind of looms over. Does that make sense? I uh, keep, yeah, it does make sense. Keep getting that vibe from the jailhouse, from a little bit when something was messing yeah. with all of our devices at the crossroads. I feel like he's around. Like, he keeps her right under his thumb. You know what I'm saying? Well, mm -hmm. apparently, he, like, ended up being a total f asshole. Mm -hmm. Literally. The one that you said sounded like shot, it almost does sound like shot. Or, I almost think it sounds like she did not. Like, like shoot that, him? Yeah, like that was him talking. You know what I mean? I think what actually happened was he shot her, and before she passed away, she shot him, and both of them died. <sighs> Whoever has been answering our questions, thank you. We really appreciate you. Cross. Cross! Cross! cross. Oh, what that? the? Look, look, look! It says cross! That literally maxed out right before it said cross. Really? It did. So you know where we are. We're standing at your grave, or what people say is where you're buried. We think that even you confirmed that you're buried here. Ugly. Uh, did it say ugly? It did. <laughs> face. Ugly, ugly face. face! What the f Are you talking about me or one of us? Whatever. I know I'm ugly. I don't care. I'm a three. That doesn't matter. Mona, I may be ugly, but you're beautiful. Okay? Grave. Grave! Oh, no dude! Way, dude. Whoa! That says grave. This is definitely Mona or somebody who is like pretending to be Mona. I mean, come on, dude. We're at a grave right now. They say cross and then they say grave. Who are you talking about, Mona? Who's ugly? Whoa! What if it is whoever was watching us when we were at the crossroads? Maybe. Because mm. they said ugly face. Mm -hmm. Mona, are you talking about one of us or somebody else? We are here. We Whoa. are here. We. Plural. That's what I'm saying. Her and the husband. I hated my life. Oh! Whoa. What? We're so sorry you were treated that way, Mona. Whoa. We noticed that people still kind of treat you horribly. Your grave has been trashed. And it is very unfortunate. Stop them. Stop, stop them. them. What would you like us to do? You want us to stop them from disrespecting you? We could try our best. We'd have to send a couple of... Uh, what did, what did they call the messengers back in the day? I have a message for you. Oh! <laughs> did, did, what is happening, bro? <laughs> um, those postmen? <laughs> Guys? Hmm? Did you just hear that whistle or scream? Yeah. It was a scream. As I was trying to say, we could probably send a couple of letters in the mail. He will harm you. He, he will, will harm, harm you. you. He will Dude, harm you. I swear I just heard a scream. Help. Help. I don't know exactly what you need our help with. Can you try and be more specific, please? This is getting intense. See my shadow. See my shadow. See my shadow. Is this somebody else? Would you like us to leave your grave alone? We just wanted to pay a quick visit and have a conversation with you. She seemed like she calmed down. Is there something wrong? Something that we don't know? Right. I think it, it has something to do with the husband. Mona, we just want to say thank you so much. Someone is following you. Whoa. Someone, Someone is, one is following. Dude, I wonder if it's from the crossroads. Mm -hmm. Did we f something off? Look at it. Look at it. See my shadow. Someone is following you. Look at it. I don't know, guys. That's weird. We don't want to overstay our welcome. So we are going to respect Isabella. you. It oh! Oh! No! no. Isabel! No. Bella. Isabella! Oh, there's oh, no. I died. I died. I died. Dog. Oh Dude. my god. Holy this thing maxed like three times right before that happened too. Holy! We got both of her her 
names. Dude. That is incredible. What are the odds it comes out when we're literally standing right in front of her cross? That's yeah, and about to leave. Isabella on it. I have one more spot I'd like to go. We are really not trying to overdo it here. We came here, we're paying our respects, having a conversation with Mona slash Isabella. Yeah. Both of her names. The fact that we got cross, grave, both of the names, lots of spikes, some EVPs here, proves to us that she is here. She's definitely here. Right. This is crazy. There is one last spot that we would like to go to before we do leave and before the cold completely all of our camera batteries. Now we have been here for eight hours, so we only have a couple of batteries left. With all that being said, we would like to go to this last spot and do an Estes method. So, let's go. Right now, I'm gonna blindfold myself, put on headphones that are connected to the spirit box, tune myself out, and allow the spirits to use my voice as their own. This is called the Estes method, and it's my first time. <laughs> okay, can you guys see? How many fingers am I holding up? Five. Good. To the spirits who are around us right now, we are trying this method where you can use one of us as your voice. I'm here. Who are you? I don't know what that said. What is your name? Murder. Oh! <laughs> Were you here? In this town, Rhylite? My body's over there. I was Oh, dude! Oh my god. Did we talk to you earlier tonight? Or are you somebody new? Have you seen us tonight? I've been with you. Oh, He's here. He. Is that the uh, negative entity? The negative energy? Is it a man? Don't be afraid. Oh, whoa. What? A real clear woman's voice? Mona, is that you? Are you here with us? I'm here. Oh. I miss, oh my God. A woman's voice just said, I miss my something. I miss my something. This is crazy. Dude, dude that was crazy. <laughs> it was like, I miss my. River didn't catch the last part of what you said. Can you say it to him again? What do you miss? Living. Life. Oh my God. Remember when we were just at her grave, it said I had a terrible life? Or yes. Something? Yep. Mona, were you okay with us being at your grave? Was that okay? Look behind you. Oh, f me. What? Did you just, oh, f me. He's right there. Oh. What'd you see? Oh, there's another statue. Yes, that's what I, oh I said. Oh, me because I saw the damn statue. See a thing? Where are you? We can't see you with our own eyes. Oh my God, a, a really deep man's voice just said he's evil. There's that. That was like he's and then like a really hard evil. That was instant. What the f Mona, do you know his name? I did hear that. What is that? Dude, that sounds like someone walking down the street with like a stick or something. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's bouncing. Yeah. Bing, bing, bing. Are we in danger? Is there something we should be worried about here? Dude, it's getting louder. If you want to be. What the hell? We do not want to be in danger. We are only here to document the unknown. Oh my god! Again, it said he's behind! Where? Where are you? We cannot see you. You do not have permission to harm any of us. As I was saying, we are here trying to document the unknown. We're trying to prove that the afterlife does exist. But here's my question. Why are you still here? Is there any way you're able to move on and not be here? Can you tell us that, please? Do you know that answer? If you are using River as your voice, try and be as clear as possible. This is the only way we understand. No, thank you, I was killed. Then a voice, a man's voice came in afterwards, almost like, uh, like they were arguing. Maybe her husband again. Mona, is that your husband? Has he been with us this whole time as well? Crossroads. Oh, f that's not good. 
Whoa, dude. And then another voice just said something. It's crazy because these are like the same voices. When this town was very active with the gold mining, did people ever try and sell their souls to you? Or at the crossroads? Did they actually accomplish selling their souls? Whoa, dude, no, I didn't like that. That was like a f demonic ass f voice, dude. As we we're asking about the crossroads. You cannot harm River. Remember, he is just your voice. Do not harm him. You have no permission. Come back. Come back. Like back over there? Back so you can see. So you can see the crossroads. Oh. Oh my god. Uh, the same woman's voice, same woman's voice just came out. What did that say, dude? Mona, say it again, please. You're doing great, thank you. Thank you so much. Come back so you can see. Are you kidding me? Did you... Did you hear that? Dude, I keep hearing this girl's voice and it's so hard to understand. You heard that, right? Yeah. It was like, ah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude. That same f weird, hissing, demonic style of voices keeps popping up. I literally just f heard that. I thought that was River. Mona, we just want to say thank you for talking to us, for giving us a chance, for trusting us. We would like to come back and talk to you again. Are you okay with that? Really deep voice just said, you're not done. Oh. Uh. What does that mean? Unfinished. Oh! What we did at the crossroads. To that evil entity, we didn't even start anything. We just went to the crossroads to find out if we could have a conversation with somebody who could give us some answers. So by you saying that this is unfinished, it is finished. As of right now, like I was saying, Mona, thank you. We are going to go ahead and pull River out. Don't look at him. Don't look at him. That's what our device said. That's exactly what the device said. Should we get him out? Probably before this thing pops up. Hey, Riv. You good? What? You're good. We're good. I'm good? Yeah, we're good. Dude, that is freaky. Holy. I just, I don't want to over, I don't want to overdo it. It's your first time, and holy, f that was crazy. That's like a really f crazy experience. It's, it's isn't intense, isn't it? Like I kept hearing this woman's voice, the same woman's voice, over and over and over. But a lot of the times it was just so hard to understand. But then you had a male's voice that was like demonic. Oh, you didn't hear that? No. You didn't hear that? No. Dude, shut the f up. What was it? Rustling of the branch. Something's saying unfinished, I man. I know what that. that means. It's the crossroads. It has to be. There is no doubt in my mind that we talked to Mona. Yeah. The fact that we were getting warnings right away when we were at the crossroads mm -hmm. from a woman. Right. right away, I knew who this woman could have been because there's such a huge story that people have come in contact with Mona. The fact that we got both of both. her names, mm -hmm. that's insane mm -hmm. to me that this was Mona. Yeah. Bottom line, what I am trying to say is that she is here. Once again, to all of the spirits here who had a conversation with us, who was around, we want to say thank you. To the dark energy, the evil entity, you do not have any permission to harm us. Oh my God. That, didn't, that did not do any whole thing, time. the whole Estes method. Guys, I think we need to make a return. Yeah. I think we need to come back. Probably. Oh, oh, Jesus, we, dude. Holy f This is weird. This is, dude, I'm, we my mind is with me. Dude, I, okay, so I looked over there. I f you not. I had this weird flash. The tall f ghost mannequin that's not f real. I saw it move. There's no way that it actually f moved, but my mind just saw it move. Dude, we gotta get the hell out of here. I know, I'm starting to trip this out. That, it's terrific. obviously it did not move, but my mind is playing tricks on me right now. Holy Guys, if you want us to come back, 
let's get this video to 50,000 likes. That lets us know that you do want us to make a return here. We would love to make a return. We would love to continue to talk to Mona and maybe try and dig a little deeper into this whole crossroads thing. This is our very first time ever dabbling in any of that. It's good because we document as much as we can. With all that being said, we hope you did enjoy this episode. If you are new to this channel or you keep finding yourselves coming back and you are not subscribed, please make sure you hit the subscribe button. We are on our way to 800,000 subscribers. That milestone is so big for us. And thank you, everyone who is watching this. Thank you, everyone who is subscribed. Whoever you are, thank you. With all of that being said, we love you all and we will see you next week. Peace. I want to say it this time. Okay. With all that being said, we love you all. I just want to put his nose in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs>